All right, we're up here at Chuck Hutton getting her oil change. Um, we're going to drop it off and um, head on to Papa Murphy's. I saw Chaboom on Twitter. Uh, they have a uh, new pizza out, uh, Chicken Alfredo. I've never ate at Papa Murphy's. And come to find out, it says take and bake. So take and bake, I guess that means you take it and bake it. So I've never ate there, so we're going we're gonna to try that out. I think she's ate there one time. Okay, well, we're gonna head up there now. I'm hungry, I've been, I've been eating freaking menthol cough drops because I'm hungry, it's almost cursed. See you up there. Go for a stop recording. All right, we're up here at Chuck Hutton getting her oil change. Um, we're gonna drop it off and um, head on to Papa Murphy's. I saw Chaboom on Twitter. Uh, they have a uh, new pizza out, uh, Chicken Alfredo. I've never ate at Papa Murphy's and come to find out it says take and bake. So take and bake, I guess that means you take it and bake it. So I've never ate there, so we're gonna, we're gonna try that out. I think she's ate there one time. Okay, well, we're gonna head up there now. I'm hungry, I've been, I've been eating freaking menthol cough drops because I'm hungry, it's almost cursed. See you up there. Go for a stop recording. Okay, we are here. Um, we're gonna get the chicken Alfredo um, and what else did you get? I don't know. It's stinking. It's stinking. Okay, I'll let you. It's a surprise. It's a surprise to me too. Um, so uh, we'll let you know when we get out of here uh, what we got and uh, take it from there. Why is it so foggy? It's a big smudge on here. My greasy fingers. There we go. Look at the hell. Okay. GoPro stop recording. GoPro stop recording. Okay, I was wondering why on the app there's a 30 minute pickup as the minimum. And I'm like, if you're, and I'm thinking you just go to the grocery aisle and, and get the pizza out the refrigerator or freezer and take it home and cook it. Uh, take and bake is what it's called. It's make, take, and bake. Okay, they got to make it first. Then you can take it, then bake it. Didn't even know that part of it. So, uh, 30 minutes uh, if you use the app. And I think I got a $3 off thing in the email. So maybe maybe we can use that. I'm not sure. Uh, but I just had to get that out there. I'll let you guys know. Um, if you're really hungry, you can't just stop by the store and pick one up. Unless they have like 10 available. Do they just hurry up and make a, like a certain one? I don't think they do. No? Okay. It's like out. a pizza of the day. Check out. Um, one second. Let me get this, um, see if there's a, 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 a coupon on here and I'll be right back with you. Go post stop recording. <laughs> All right. It didn't take 30 minutes. They said they don't know why the, the app does the 30 minutes. It only takes like five or minutes or so, but I was in there talking a little bit. They asked me if I had a YouTube channel and the manager came back too. Cause Hey, I saw, guess what he said? I saw this card somewhere. It was on a urinal. urinal. I said, probably Walmart. <laughs> Real cool people. So um, I'll show you a little better at home. But this, uh, the Alfredo comes with mushrooms, not in a can, because she does not like canned mushrooms. And the, 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 the uh, one of the associates in there said she doesn't like mushrooms either, but she likes these. So uh, we got the mushrooms, spinach, Alfredo sauce, chicken, and the one that she has here, three cheeses, is, I want to say mozzarella, 
Parmesan and herb and garlic. So you I, tried real hard to say that word wrong. <laughs> I told her in there. I told her in there. I'm gonna say herb. You, you pushed it out real hard. You like that? No. <laughs> but I told her in there. I said I said herb. I said I say quesadilla and everything else too. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get home. We're gonna. Uh, they said to set this off for 30 minutes. So it's gonna be 30 minutes by the time we get there and be ready to pop in the oven. You ready? That's how you're gonna put them in the oven. And you're gonna clean up that mess, you throw them in there like Woo that. Too. Okay. Hey guys, it smells smells freaking delicious in here. There we go. Grab my phone real quick. You know what I gotta do? We're gonna put this out of this in here and I got a, I got all the other pictures already okay and get me one of these one of these okay make sure this is running oh. Oh. Uh, put this in my hand for me I'll be done. Okay, you thought I was gonna drop it, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, folks. Um, this says preheat oven to 425 or 350 for stuffed. Um, remove plastic, blah blah. Bake 12 to 18 minutes. This was 12 minutes, and this was 18 because how thin that is. We're gonna eat this first because it actually um, was going to cool down real quick. That's a Pokemon looking thing, huh? That's a fancy cutter I had got from Amazon. It might be on the recommendations, the Amazon recommendations on my website. So you might want to check that out um, if it works good. Do you want it cut in squares or triangles? Or? Oh, oh, I don't care. Unless you want to do a challenge. It needs to be sharper, don't it? I don't think I don't so. Care. No. No? Okay. I forgot what I paid for that, but it's on there. I on think the this one was like 12. five something or this one wasn't much. That? Oh, you talking oh, about this? No. This uh this was seven dollars for that pizza. Um and this one here was thirteen dollars. But if you signed up for uh Papa Murphy's, um you get three dollars off. So all this came to eighteen dollars with tax. You want me to cut that one? Um, okay, but go ahead and get, give me some pizza on that one. Um, but there's like three locations here in the Memphis area. There's not many Papa Murphy's here. I know Philadelphia doesn't because I talked to uh, Bob and he said that he never heard of the place. So oh, this could stay in here longer. It could. Yeah. Uh oh. Well. I can't blame anybody but myself for cooking it. I can't say, hey, you cooked it wrong. Yeah, it kind 
Billy. So I can do it okay. Do you want to put it in there while we eat this one then? Yeah. Okay. Well, that was quick. Okay. Well. That was quick. I mean, saying yeah. Okay. Put it back in. Sounds. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yours is good on the bottom. Yours is yours too. Okay, I got my other phone over here just so you get a close up. Oh, the party? <laughs> I get it. Coke, coffee, and pizza. If I name it that. And there you go. He bought Coca Cola with coffee. Oh, I, was right. I think Brian. I think Brian had told me about this. Uh, uh, there's like 30 people that told me about this. Um, and uh, You're going to show it on your phone so oh, I can see it up close? Sure. Got the coffee pan on the front. They got the caramel up top. And action. Okay. We're gonna taste the pizza first. Yay! All righty. Mm. Are yours cheesy? I like the spices they use in it. I'm a fan of Alfredo sauce on pizzas. It is good. It's not this like a good. generic either. Like it's good flavor. Like a, you go to a buffet and have the Alfredo. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's just like a generic watery. They got some very stretchy yeah. cheese. I see. A cheese pull. <laughs> it's pretty good. How are the mushrooms? The okay. mushrooms are good. I'm glad that they don't use canned mushrooms because that's yeah, the rubbery. Like it's like a rubbery can. Yeah. I'm not a fan. Good For good years, I thought I didn't like. I thought I didn't like mushrooms, but what it was is I had never had fresh mushrooms. Okay. Hopefully, this is done enough. We did another three minutes. So basically, they both was about 16 to 18 minutes. And that one, I saw them put the um, a scoop full of minced garlic. It wasn't the garlic powder. I have all this stuff over here, garlic powder and black pepper. I might like a little extra spice, but uh, they put all the other herbs and uh, stuff on it. It's thin, like thin, thin crust. Yeah, but it didn't get, I don't know, it didn't get crispy like it's... No? Like like mine? No, it's not at huh. all. I don't know. Maybe I cooked it right the first time. Are that we pizza? tasting this one yet? Mm-hmm. I was just making sure I did it right. Yeah, this didn't get crispy. I realized after we got done doing this shoot um, that I put the pizza on top of the, the other pizza that had a harder crust. So the steam actually um, softened that crust up. So I wouldn't do them um, upper decker type deals. I would do them separate. I taste the garlic. 
Yo, oh, yeah. You can never have enough garlic on it, but they did put a nice heaping um, tablespoon of garlic on this pizza. Um, it was minced. It wasn't the dry, dehydrated, or, or anything, so. Whenever I heat this one back up, I'm going to do it on a piece of stone so the crust could be crispy. Okay. That's the only complaint I have on this one, and mm -hmm. you got to point your finger at me on that one? No, because I don't think that's, like, I know you're trying not to burn the... The top and all that. Mm -hmm. But well, if you get one of the thin crust, if you have a piece of stone at home, I guess you need to cook it first on this to be able to get it off of this. Because when they put the the crust on there, it's raw. So it's no way you can get home and transfer it to a, a piece of crust. But my suggestion is to cook it some so it'll get a little firm. And if you like, crispy your crust like I do huh I don't know why I was flashing I guess I don't know. maybe I said the wrong thing did you it's your fault I don't know you said it but like I was saying you can finish it off on the piece of stone to have it a little crispier or to have it crispy at all because as you can see it's not this isn't it's done but it's it's not crispy before I put this in the oven I, the house is smelling good already before I even started cooking. Usually when it's about done, you, you start smelling what's in the oven. But uh, I do commend them on that. They have some fresh ingredients right in your face so you can see it. That's good. Okay. What one use in a minute? I want to try that. What? Hmm? What you just I'm going to try it down. I hope drink. you didn't taste it. Go ahead. You don't want to waste your pizza by tasting it? This is in the energy drink aisle deal. I guess that's an energy drink without putting the extra energy um, chemicals in there. It's nasty on top. Well, the coffee and caramel, I think, actually kill that. Okay. It's advertised. I think I saw advertising like that. You think you did? Kill all the dirt. Okay. We'll take an intermission and we'll be right back. <laughs> oh, we got our nails done too. They always comment on your nails and you didn't get to do a close up. There you go. Okay, there you go. I don't need this anymore since we got the close up of your nails. It's a nail review channel. Okay. Smells like regular Coke. Don't smell like coffee or car caramel, car up caramel. I say caramel. You know what I'm talking about. I should have had two cans. I can taste the coffee at the end. Like at first, you don't taste it. I taste. You kinda I taste, taste the caramel when you. you taste it the, tastes like Coke and caramel, and then you get the coffee after. Yeah, it's like a a whiff, like a whoo, coffee. Yeah, and the aftertaste left in your mouth is coffee. Yeah, because that, that 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 right when it's trying to switch over is really weird. It's like seltzer water kind of thing. That's different. It's different. It's not. I wouldn't buy it again. That's how it's different. It's good to me. You like it? It's yours. I mean, it's not good enough for me Christmas. to buy it again, but because I'm not a coffee drinker. Oh, like not, I wouldn't buy. Yeah, I wouldn't buy it. That's different. Yeah. Who thought to put? Everybody's doing everything. Chicken, like chicken wars. They got to do something different. That's just like they have to. Like, oh, we got to put something new out. Charge more money for it. I have to check and see how much, cause you know I'm not supposed to drink uh, energy drinks. So hopefully it's just regular. It's coffee. not an alcohol aisle. If it's an alcohol aisle, like the energy drinks, it means it has a little bit of alcohol in it. You know that? There's two different. 
is a in the case where the alcohol is. I'm just saying energy drinks. Period. Well, I'm just saying I was just letting them know if they oh. didn't know if it's near the, if it's in the alcohol, it has a little alcohol in it. Some oh well, I don't, a lot of grocery stores don't have <coughs> alcohol in it. But I didn't know that. Okay. okay, well, I'll, I don't have anything else to add, but I will go back here to try a few more different kind of pizzas. Maybe a pizza challenge there. They're really nice people. So I'm going to um, definitely try maybe one of those pizzas, what, in maybe a minute and a half? I'll, t I, I, I'll see. It's soft enough to be able to do it for you at, at maybe, I think. I, but I can't do it there unless I do it. I can do it like pre cooked. Like, just do it like a pre cooked cup of Murphy. Pizza? I have the world's record, probably, because nobody probably is stupid enough to do it. I wouldn't recommend you eat raw. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well, this is another review, guys. Um, we're going to shut this down. But if you like Papa Murphy's, let us know in the comments what is the best pizza you like from there um, and what kind of deals you get. Because I got $3 off if you signed up on the app. So I, I am a fan of the apps. Sometimes I don't get to use the apps because I'm always in a rush. I'm like, I'm like right there and I just need to order what I need to order. Um, but I do like to save coupons and, and, and go that route. But a lot of times it's not playing that far ahead. It's just like, excuse me. This is a new thing out. I have to do it. So. Go out and try the chicken Alfredo pizza. It's really good. Definitely. Definitely. I would say. It's I really not, don't know it's what. It's not bland at all or anything. Yeah. The, the, the cooking it the way I did. Oh, yeah. It has some texture to it. So. Okay. Well. Other than that. Because yeah, you didn't even add any extra. See, no, I, I didn't. To it. I didn't need to. Maybe some black pepper here and there, but um, I'm good with what's on there. So, thanks again, guys, for watching. Please share um, with your friends, family, even your boss. Uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. I don't know what's wrong with you. Um, and hit the like button if you don't like it. Something is wrong with you. So, talk to you later. Bye. Well, so you you about to say something on me, and you dropped it. GoPro, stop recording. Hey, thanks for watching the video again. If you haven't visited my website yet, um, the, the address is www.dougarbagedisposalstore.com. You can navigate through the top, all these links right here. Um, there is actually a question and comment form. If you have any questions or comments, uh, fill that out, and it'll go straight to my email. At the very bottom, there is a free newsletter. Just sign up for right here, um, and you will get a weekly newsletter. So uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting on? Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit see all so you get all the notifications and don't miss the videos. Please comment. I like to um, listen to your comments uh, and respond to you. So I do like to interact with you guys. Uh, please share the video with your friends, family, even your boss. And have a great day. Let's meet other plans.